Well, as some of you are aware, uh, several weeks ago, we lost two of New York's finest, uh, Rafael Ramos uh, and Wen Jin Lu. Uh, they were serving yeah. their community with great honor uh, and dedication and courage. And uh, all of New York grieved and all of the nation grieved. And it was a reminder of the incredibly uh, difficult and dangerous work uh, that so many of our law enforcement officers are engaged in every single day. Uh, I had a chance to meet uh, the families uh, of officers Ramos and Lou at the memorial that we did uh, just a few days ago. But it's important for us not only to uh, honor their memory, it's also important for us to make sure that we do everything we can to help uh, ensure the safety uh, of our police officers uh, when they're in the line of duty. And this legislation, uh, which has been sponsored on a bipartisan basis uh, by uh, people like Senators Cardin uh, and Representatives uh, Reichert and uh, Pascrell, uh, represent, I think, the best of uh, uh, a bipartisan support for law enforcement. Uh, what this legislation is going to do is to uh, initiate a blue alert system so that when uh, we know there is an active threat against law enforcement that the alerts are going out at a uh, comprehensive, uh, expeditious way. Uh, that prevents the, uh, the possibility that uh, other officers may be caught by surprise and uh, it ensures that uh, appropriate steps uh, can be taken uh, as quickly as possible. Done. Thank you, Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you guys. Thank you.